Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, uh, interact and also learn. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, a mathematics teacher. And in today's lesson, we we'll form to lesson eight. And the topic is uh, the logarithm. And the sub uh, topic is we are, are going to deal with the division of a bar or a logarithm with a negative number. And to the lesson objective, by the end of this lesson, you should be able to number one, divide a logarithm uh, with a bar. Uh, then number two, multiply numbers using mathematical uh, table. Uh, then uh, the first uh, question is division of logarithm with a bar. Uh, this example one ever read, uh, given that the logarithm of uh, number x is equal to bar 2.9342 uh, uh, divided by 3. What you are supposed to do, you are supposed to make uh, the bar to become a factor of the denominator. And therefore, because you have a bar 2, you are supposed to minus you subtract one and then you add one uh, so that you can get bar three uh, therefore you will subtract uh, uh, one from bar one and after subtracting uh, one from bar two you will get bar three and the one that you subtract you get it as positive and therefore you will treat it as a positive and you treat the the bar and the positive side as two uh, independent uh, sums and therefore you will say bar three divided by three then you plus one are uh, the one you subtracted uh, 0.9342 you divide also by three and therefore by uh, bar three divided by three you'll get bar one uh, then a uh, 1.9342 divided by three you will end up getting 0 0.6 and therefore you combine bar 1 uh, plus 0 .0, uh, 0 0.6447 then you will get the answer as one bar 1.6447 uh, then uh, we'll come to the second uh, uh, part uh, then uh, example to, uh, another example uh, find the uh, antilogarithm of uh, 0 0.3472 remember what you're supposed to do you will write this 0 0.3472 in the uh, logarithm column then you look uh, on the x uh, column that is 34 and in the middle column you look 7 uh, you look at digit 7 and therefore the number that coincide with digit 7 and 34 uh, becomes a uh, 2 0.223 uh, then uh, you move to the last uh, column that is the third column and where we have the digit 2 then you drop up to where we have uh, 34 it coincide with the column of 34 and it uh, you will get it as one then you add then you will get 2.22 4 then times uh, 10 to power 0 remember this 0 uh, this 0 which I'm putting here 10 to power 0 is the 0 in the logarithm uh, and therefore the 0 in the logarithm represent uh, the power of the standard form when the number is written in the standard form uh, 10 to power 0 this 0 here is the one which is normally placed at the logarithm and then therefore any number is to power 0 is equals to 1 and therefore this number if you multiply by 1 which is 10 to power 0 Zero, which is equals to one uh, you are supposed to get the same same number and therefore our number becomes 2.224 then uh, we will go to the this another example uh, in this case we are going to look at uh, uh, logarithm uh, the antilogarithm of uh, uh, 2 point uh, 3947 uh, that, that is uh, 2.3947 and therefore uh, you can see this number which is here in the logarithm they present the power uh, of 10 and therefore you write 10 to power 2 then you go to the antilogarithm uh, you look at that uh, 39 in the first column in the x column and in the middle column you look at 4 and the number that coincide with 39 uh, and uh, the second uh, middle column uh, 4 uh, the number which coincide is 2.477 and therefore uh, you move to the third column and that uh, in the third column uh, you drop up to where we have 39 the row of 39 then the figure there, uh, you will find it as 4, and therefore you come and you add 4 here, then you will get 2.481, uh, 
uh, 2.481 then remember you are supposed to multiply by 10 to power 2 and 10 to power 2 is 100 therefore 2.481 uh, the, then you multiply by 100 you will get 248.1 uh, as the answer uh, so we will go to the division of positive logarithm and the example one uh, divide the following logarithm uh, that is uh, uh, 0 0.3496 divided by 2 and therefore this one because there is no bar uh, you can simply use uh, um, a calculator or you just say 0 divided by 2 you get 0 then uh, 3 divided by 2 uh, you will get 1 carry 1 and uh, then 14 divided by 2 you will get is 6 carry 2 then uh, you will get uh, 7 I mean because it is 14 uh, you will get uh, 7 because of 14 and uh, then you will go to 9 divided by 2 you will get uh, the answer is 4 because it becomes 8 uh, 9 minus 8 you will get 1 then 16 uh, divided by 2 you will get 8 and the same case applies to 1.2762 you divide by 2 uh, you can just basically use a calculator and you will get the answer as 0 0.6381 and therefore if the bar is not available you are not supposed to restrict yourself but you are supposed to use a calculator there is no problem uh, then we have come to the end of today's lesson and you are supposed to do the following assignment the first question using antilogarithm find the exact number of the following logarithms are uh, 0 0.7892 that is part a and part b are uh, the logarithm uh, you look for the antilogarithm of uh, the, this logarithm which is log, log 3.92978 uh, then for reference you can refer from secondary students a mathematics book uh, book 2 and the publisher is the Kenya Literature Bureau for more information you can reach us at LMTV using the following addresses you can use the SMS using the number which is well displayed for you the YouTube and also Facebook platform at LMTV and finally you can use use Twitter at Twitter at LMTV underscore KE. Thank you for joining me in this lesson. Till next lesson. Bye bye.